relying in one religion or in one spirituality has changed my life you know i became more broader in the mind like in resolving even problems or challenges in my life or not relying on an outside source to be happy you know and i'm not saying i'm always happy or I'm the happiest person in the universe. Yes, I do get sad, I do get angry. It's it's part of us. It is it's part of this body that we are inside in this moment, you know. But as much as we know that being angry, being sad, it's uh, a negative emotion. You know, it's a negative energy related emotion we shouldn't strive to change it or strive to conquer it we should just observe it you know and and see every emotion as it passes by and just be you know and in order to do that is with meditation and when you meditate you just still your mind you just observe every energy that comes through and you are able to see that um which one resonate with you which one is good for you which one will bring better results in the future you know um good karma you know and tune into a frequency that is god conscious you know a frequency of love a frequency of positive energy and when i now feel that energy i feel that my life is complete you know it completes me so i'm not saying that i have reached the ultimate i'm not saying that i i'm enlightened i'm still on the journey and i still have a long way to go but i'm just saying that i'm enjoying the journey so enjoying this journey it's what i chose that my life would be because if you are so focused in um being enlightened or reaching nirvana you are actually being attached to nirvana and you shouldn't be attached to achieving nirvana but enjoy this journey enjoy the moment and just be without having those attachments just accepting every situation accepting every step that there would be good steps and there would, there would be bad steps in life you know there would be good moments and there would be bad moments there would be happy moments and there would be sad moments and when you enjoy life in that way you do see the completeness of who god is the tao you know the yin and yang both sides just coexisting together so i found that this new age life is more of something that makes you free but something that actually helps you as well to realize that life is about karma life is about the energy that you give out is the energy that will come in the energy that you will receive you know so if you give out positive energy you will receive that positive energy back and even 10 times more so it's wonderful to just live life going with the flow of positive energy but not being so limited or not being so bottled up and having so many boundaries that oh I can only do this but when you live freely positively and knowing that you are governed by karma you will be a free being a being that will be able to experience life in a broader sense a being that doesn't take that much effort 
into reaching nirvana because you are not so attached into reaching that nirvana but you are just living your life enjoying the journey to nirvana and just enjoying that journey that is what will help us reach nirvana so we are imperfect beings and we should just realize that life is impermanent but with that you become happy because every moment counts you are not now living life only thinking about the future that if i do this or if this happens i will be happy but you are living life knowing that happiness has to be now and happiness is now you know happiness is a, a state of mind that you choose don't be happy because of an outside source but be happy because you now know that in life all is imperfect in life all is impermanent and in life all has a beginning has a maturing state and it has an ending you know but anyway um i've said too much and i know i might be getting off topic a little bit so yeah thank you for giving me the chance and for asking me to speak about my life mm, it's something that i don't do usually because this is uh it's my life you know what i mean <laughs> Okay, um, thank you for watching and thank you for taking your time to give me this opportunity to just share with you about my life and please comment below. Tell me about your life. Yes, thank you. Thank you so much. May you continue to have a beautiful life. May you continue to be happy and know that you should live in this moment enjoy our time with our closest meditate do yoga eat healthy and yeah have a beautiful life eh? i'm sending you love and light namaste rastafari hotel